Uh, I, I heard you talk about the, the chamber, football, the, the black yes, stars. Yeah, quick one on the quick black, one on the black stars. Then... Uh, <laughs> my favorite Indomie flavor is onion chicken. You know, onion chicken flavor. You know, I did a post on the 22nd, was it 22nd of June? I'll just read exactly what I said so that people realize that in this town, when you speak the truth, Ghanaians don't like you. I did a post 10, 22, 25th of June. I said, you can't score Benin, Benin Republic, or Nigeria, or Tunisia, or Egypt, no come yet. Young Koti, a year of return. You will not return with even Indomie. Disband the black stars and build a new team from the under-21 level. A mansion built on a weak foundation will fail. Simplicita. Ghanaian journalists and politicians and everybody insulted me and insulted my late grandfather. I'm not a patriot. Patriotism, <clears throat> patriotism is standing up for your country and speaking the truth even when it is not popular. And that's what I did. I showed I'm a patriot by saying that, look, the black stars as we have now, yes, you will lose because... The team you have is incompetent. The team you have is reflective of the government that we have. Yeah. Incompetent. How, how does a team reflect a government? Ah, okay, let me, a, show you. let me show you. Football you have, players. You have, you have a coach so that is technically bankrupt, President Akufuado. <laughs> you have a captain who has, who has gone past his prime. Osafoma for prime minister. You have a general captain. Or a general captain who, who, who is more of a Jamal leader. Baumia. <laughs> it's completely reflective of the team, and I can take it player by player and show you the representatives in the, in, the, in the government setup. Look, you have a team. Would we not have been shocked at Ghanaian or African football if this Ghanaian team that showed no technical and tactical discipline won the AFCON? Let's call a spade a spade. Look, I have always maintained the team that under President Kufo qualified us for our first World Cup in 2006 in Germany. That team was built by my predecessor. It started work by my predecessor, Honorable E.T. Mensah, in 98. From under 17. The ACNs, the Steven Apiers, there was a progressive plan. They started from Ghanaman and Prom Prom. Built that team, kept them together. They were in Teshi before that. Then. That team, <laughs> well, you mean buttress my point, from Teshi to Ghanaman to yeah. where they got to. Okay, that team was, this, was, was what took us to the, our first World Cup. You saw the beauty of the Black Stars in Germany. And then even four years later in South Africa, that is when we became the toast of the world. I was in South Africa in 2010. And at a, when, when, when the, the South African team got the, knocked out, South Africans, the whole of Africa was behind Ghana. They were calling the Black Stars Bagana Bagana. That was a team that was built. What plan did we do for a succession? The, the day team that went and won the World Cup in, in Egypt in 2010, how many of those players are still in the Black Stars apart from Dede and Jonathan Menza? We have not built a team to go. You have a coach who, who, who has absolutely no technical understanding. He goes with one formation, route, route one. That is it. When the, the formation is varied, nothing. What's the way forward? Wrap up on this one. The way forward, the I've stated in my, in my state, in, in my post of 25th. Get the whole team down. Pull the I said, whole team I said down. look, and... I won't lie. The happenings in Brazil. I have become a. I became a critic of the Black Stars even when the NDC was in government. From Brazil, I thought that those boys did not show patriotism with their actions in Brazil. And when you say they are patriots and patriots, this this Egypt they've gone. If they were patriots, they would wear our national colours with pride. How many of those boys? Tell me any one of those boys in the Black Stars who earns eighty thousand dollars in two weeks. They got an appearance fee for $80,000. So how are they patriots? The English national team, where the players in the English national team earn hundreds of thousands of dollars, they, they wear their national colors with pride. But our boys, if you don't pay $80,000, if you don't give them winning bonus and they won't go and play, and you say they are patriots, disband the team, get a real fulcrum. If we can't get foreign players, let's build our local league. Let's get a proper national team of local players, have a development plan for the next four years, and rebuild the Black Stars. Thank okay. you.